Stephen, the truth well, is we've judged. seen the future. We've seen the future, and it's a very nasty, vindictive, hate-filled future. If you disagree with, 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 with the, the, the voice proponents, look what he said about Julie and Lisa. I mean, I'm, I'm getting older, but I, I can't think of many things worse in public life than I've ever heard than Pearson's disgusting attack on Julie and Lisa, a, a very fine man, a Jewish person, and what Pearson said about him, I mean, no, no. As I've said, you know, you can be sure that when the debate goes low, Noel Pearson will go lower. That's what's evidence well, from the other night. And now I we find out today, uh, Andrew, thanks to you that... Yeah, for viewers that don't know what you're referring to, Noel Pearson, just before Passover, very important day in the uh, Jewish uh, religious holiday uh, calendar, uh, suggested that uh, Julie and Lisa wanted Aborigines to have a little tattoo of identification on their arm, a clear reference to the Nazis, or some item on their clothing announcing they were Aborigine, <laughs> Aboriginal. Again, a clear reference to the Nazis putting the Star of David on people's uh, jacket in a nasty slur that Lisa was somehow a Nazi himself for uh, being part of the oh, Liberals no. opposing the voice. I have yeah. heard Look, I low things in politics, a, but that ranks right a, down in the sewer. I think that is that is an absolute overstatement by some magnitude, yeah. Andrew and Michael. I, don't, I heard those comments as well. Oh, really? Seriously? I'll ask our producers if they can get that clip up. I'll ask the producers if they can get that clip up, and we'll see about no that. Stephen, look, we both have to call out Nazi... extremists on our side of the argument. Yeah. Both but of us. At no stage did I, in those words or the way I believed it was meant, did he make any inference whatsoever to Nazism? I mean, if you want to talk about over the top oh. rhetoric, oh. then I invite you both to look in a mirror. I mean, what would be good is if we oh, had a more Stephen. civil discourse. If we had a more civil discourse by all parties. I don't think it helps the yes case when you see commentary like that. But let me be very clear. I don't think. Those sorts of comments that have been said in the heat of decisions that were taken last week, I can understand in the heat, but I don't think they helped the yes case. So, frankly, I would have thought that, you know, for those who are on the no side, those are the sorts of comments that allow the opposition, the no case, to be built. So I don't think those are helpful comments. Well, if it was said in the... But if I, I Pearson said that in the heat of battle, say, Stephen, I no doubt he will apologise to Julian I Lisa. Did not, I did not... No doubt he'll apologise... I did not take the same inference that you two have from those comments. I'm just sorry. I just did well, not. You, 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 you must be on another planet, Stephen, if you couldn't see that inference. And now we find Andrew... You know, we, 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 we... Yeah, let's see this. Have a look, Stephen. We've got the grab, Stephen. I don't know how you can possibly make excuses for what Noel Pearson did. We're and if a this tattoo. is a taste of what they're doing... Identifying now ourselves as to... Indigenous. Is that what he's saying? or that our clothes should be adorned with some kind of badge identifying us as Aboriginal or Torres Strait Islander? Steve Conroy, do you now accept that was a clear oh, reference no, I don't, to I don't, the Jewish Julian Lisa and the Nazis? I, think, I don't think in <laughs> any way it suggested that Julian Lisa was a Nazi. I'm sorry, that's just oh, not, not an interpretation. It was intemperate. I think it's unhelpful to the yes case. How could it and be think, not about the Nazis What was he referring to? Intemperate? What was he referring to? Uh, you're you're was saying he, he was to, making though? Nazi references to Julian Lisa, and I'm just saying I don't accept yes. your interpretation. Of Tat tattoos and badges to think, a Jewish man. I think it is... I think it is absolutely oh, intemperate God. and I don't think it is helpful. And I think if people reflected upon that, Stephen, they would understand that it was very can't both say it's intemperate and then deny what it's intemperate about. Listen, I've got to say, for me, looking at that, the hatred there from a guy that says, we yeah. are there for love, this is about uniting us, the hatred there makes me terrified what's going to happen to this country, whether or not the voice gets up, or get, uh, loses a little. And, and I have to say too, uh, Michael, that I wonder whether this is intimidating the Liberals. They are not arguing with much passion on the, on, against the voice. And I wonder if it's a fear of what will be done to them, this was a taste of it, if they lose. Well, well, Andrew, the, the, the tactic of the left in so many things is intimidation. It's abuse. It's denigration. 
That's what the left do. That's their enforcement mechanism, ridicule and abuse. Um, we've seen it, we, we see it in the left in every campaign in which they're involved. And today we find out, largely subject thanks to your column, that Marcia Lang Langton was a Trotskyist. She was a great follower of Leon Trotsky uh, when she was in her 20s, maybe into 30s, I don't know. Now, she might say, oh, well, that was years ago, as you've said before. But, but what formed her worldview that would mean that she wanted to support Leon Trotsky? Trotsky, for those that don't know their Russian history, Trotsky fell out with Stalin because he basically thought Stalin was too weak. Stalin didn't believe in an urgent world communist revolution, workers' revolution. Even though he had the great purge and he killed millions of Russians, Trotsky thought he was very weak. So Trotsky was expelled from Russia and was killed in, in Mexico. What formed Marcia Langdon's worldview in the 1970s and maybe the 80s that she thought that type of ideology was something that she wanted to fight for? And you know why you can't trust the ABC and elements of the Fairfax press? Because if she was a former Nazi, Andrew... If Langton had been a Nazi in the 70s and 80s, She'd be thrown she would have no place on any platform. No, she'd have no place on any platform in this country. Yet, yet the press have no mention of. Uh, no one asks her what was it that formed her worldview do, that, do you, to believe you, that this person a, Michael, should Michael, be someone you you'd follow. You own a mirror. You own a mirror because you need to look at it. Oh, You've just for goodness abused, sake! You just oh. have abused Noel Pearson for allegedly making a Nazi-style slur, that you're trying to say <laughs> no, Marshall Langston him. somehow... I haven't abused him. Somehow is a I've criticised them. Of, Stephen, of, Stephen, I've, I've criticised them. I haven't abused them. Oh, oh really? So saying I've someone's associated them. with Stephen, all the deaths caused Stephen, by Stalin. difference. Seriously. No, there's not. There is a difference. But I'm sorry. There is a difference. You, you have just tried to link Mark. Why, why don't you... Me. No. If your Steve, case is so strong, out. if the no case is so strong, why don't out. you make the no case? No Pearson Stop picking on the individuals. Marshall Langston. A Noel Pearson falsely accused the Jewish Julian Lisa of being a Nazi by implication, by implication, when he clearly is not. All we've said is that Marsha Langton was and Michael a Nazi, just she was. That and Michael has difference. just tried to she link was, Marsha Langston with 20 Truth. million deaths now, in Soviet Russia. There is no difference if that's, and if that's your sense. I have said nothing more beyond Andrew. that. And no, I she said was. Andrew this did. is the truth. I said Stephen. Andrew did. This is the truth. Stephen, that's she like saying because if someone was a Nazi, that's if someone all. was a that's Nazi when they were younger, now, Stephen, you're saying, oh, we're trying to link them to Adolf Hitler. Yeah, well, if you're a supporter of Adolf Hitler, you are linked by virtue of your views to, to, to what, what he did. If you support Leon Trotsky, if you support the Russian Revolution and the consequences of, of what happened in Russia, uh, yeah, you're linked to that. I mean, I'm linked to the Liberal Party because I've been a Liberal all my life. So, yes, I am linked to the Liberal Party. If you, are for, if you support the Nazi Party, you are linked to the views of Adolf Hitler. If you supported Leon Trotsky... Uh, when you're Michael, in your twenties and thirties, you when you're adult yourself, Australian, go. you are linked you to are those making views. making yourself irrelevant to this debate. Why don't you get back to the facts gentlemen, of the debate? In the no, points gentlemen, you no, it's not a real... I'm sorry, I've got to go. We're out of time. We didn't get to our, uh, the real topic I wanted to get on to, but thank you so much for the discussion, Michael Craig with Steve Conroy.